Hi everybody, it's Parker from TestPrepChampions.com and we're going to do another GED Math practice problem of the day. So go ahead, pause the video, try it out on your own first. Okay, so we're going to cover a skill here. This is addition without a calculator. And for some of you, this might be a review or this might be pretty easy for you. And that's good. But if not, then we're going to learn how to do it right now. So this is something you'll definitely need to know how to do. And so the best way to do it, whenever you see a question that's written like this, is to just stack the numbers on top of each other. So I'm going to rewrite this. We've got 572, and we want to add this to 154. Okay, and we want to find the sum. So that word sum just means addition. So we're just going to add these numbers up, and we're not going to use a calculator here. Okay, so what's 4 plus 2? Hopefully you know that 6 just for memorizing addition tables, but if not, here's a way you could do it. I think I learned this back in elementary school. You, you hit yourself or you hit something, and you would say 4. Five, six. So you hit yourself for that one number, like four, and then since it's two plus four, you would just do one, two, put up two fingers, and then you'd say, well, four, five, six. So that's how we know it's six. Okay, and so five and seven, and so again, if you don't know that off the top of your head, that's okay. What you would do is just pick whichever one you want to start at. Let's do, let's do seven, because we only have five fingers in one hand, so we would go seven, eight, 9, 10, 11, 12. So I put up 5 fingers and it gives me 12. So 5 plus 7 is 12. And so what I do is we would put 2 down here and I put stack the 1 up on top here. So then I would do 1 plus 5, which is 6, plus another 1 is 7. Our answer is 7, 26. So again, if you know your basic addition off the top of your head, then it'll be a lot faster. But if not, you can just count on your hands like the way I just showed you. And then just remember that whenever the number is 10 or bigger, that you just put down, put the second digit down here, and then the first digit goes up. So what I mean by that, and the number 12, okay, the first digit is the one, and then the second digit would be the two. So you take, we took that second digit, and we put it down here, and then the first digit goes up here, and then you just add them. And that's how you do it. So hopefully this video is helpful for you. And like I said, this might be easy in a review for some people, but for others, that's okay if it's not. Stick with it and you're going to get it. Good luck on your test.